Current estimates are that about half of all human cancers are preventable. And this is due to environmental influences and lifestyle decisions. Of course, smoking is the most important one, but surprisingly, the second most important is diet and obesity. What we eat is a complex mixture of different molecules, and not all molecules are equally good or bad for us. In particular, lipids or fats are thought to be bad for our bodies. But epidemiologically, if you look at the different kinds of lipids, you find that some are particularly bad, like palmitic acid, but some are actually beneficial for us, like stearic acid. And until now, we didn't understand why stearic acid is good in terms of preventing cancer and preventing obesity. And we recently discovered that when you eat stearic acid, it signals in your body through a specific molecular pathway to activate mitochondria. Mitochondria are the powerhouses in your cell which produce energy. And when you eat stearic acid, these mitochondria become activated and then your cells actually burn uh, more fat. And as a consequence, this reduces obesity and prevents cancer. So after we discovered the new biology in the fruit fly, we then studied human cells in culture and we recently finished a clinical study where we fed people stearic acid and we saw the same responses in people. So this is a beautiful example of how you can go from the bench with a basic model organism all the way to the clinic in people. And this is made possible by the multidisciplinary environment of the DKFZ and of the university clinic here on campus.